All right, guys. Texas cop vapes confiscated weed. <clears throat> guys, the laws in Texas around cannabis are just super, super like strict, man. Very, very strict. And this guy, this officer, this police officer, straight up wants to go out and smoke weed. Sorry, guys. Heartburn. I'm not eating all day. Let's check it out. My name is David. We're probably going to skip through a lot of this video because uh, it's, a, it's, this, it's this video on this guy's uh, page and we're not going to watch the whole video Clown. I'm a because I'm a, I'm, I'm a little bit behind on the schedule today, guys. A little bit behind, so. A criminal defense attorney in Fort Worth, Texas. A large percentage of my practice involves defense. <laughs> oh, he's got like a, you know. Got a good camera. Holy smokes, bro. He's got them. It must be a TLSR, guys. I only have it in 1080p as well. Highway drug interdiction cases uh, throughout the state. I'm here today to tell you a story about a former state trooper that has not yet been told. Former state? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Looks like he might have lost his job. And I think it needs to be told. Former Wichita County DPS trooper pleads guilty to one charge and is placed on two years probation in a drug evidence tampering case. Dang, bro. Two years. Oh, my goodness. Chad Harden of Iowa Park accepted a plea deal to tampering with or fabricating evidence with intent to impair an investigation. Guys, he looks high right there, man. Chad Harden was a trooper stationed in wichita Ka county or wichita falls in texas is a and something like that generally speaking if the the officer arrested him fair and square he didn't lie about the reason for stopping him or he didn't lie about the reason his justification to search him treated him with the respect that they were due there's no hard feelings all right we all be careful have a safe trip thank you sir yes for, sir for, for, you know, yes sir let me make it real. okay be an understanding thank yes sir there's a closure with my client as we're walking out of the courthouse. They're not mad at that officer. He was just doing his job, but not with this guy. Here, this glows with it. Back. Okay, we're gonna skip through this part. But the only thing I could uh, come with the assumption of, I wish we had the raw, raw body cam footage, guys. I looked all over for it, guys. I couldn't find it. But um, yeah, like, I forgot what I was gonna say. Um, yeah, I just prefer the body cam footage. I, I, I should, I assume he confiscates it. I mean, that's what it says in the title. There and, and getting you back there so that they can have an on-camera interview with you. They're getting ready to interrogate you on the side of the road on camera. You're going to arrest for anything? <laughs> Interrogation, bro. That's, a, that's such a scary word, in my opinion. Interrogation, it sounds scary, man. Part of my request was I wanted all videotapes. But yeah, li literally in Texas, you can get freaking nabbed for that, bro. Possession of cannabis, guys. Not sure if it's a felony. It, it, it isn't. It used to be one, bro. Uh, from this trooper's car. I wanted, I wanted not only the one pointed through the windshield, but I wanted the, 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 the videos of what's going on inside the car. And lo and behold, I got the answer that I was suspected. You know, I've had a lot of clients over the years wonder uh, when the police took their, took their marijuana if they weren't using a little bit. Oh, snap, guys. Look, there he is. Themselves. And I can say that there have been times where I had a client that had just been He's hitting it right in front of the dash cam, guys. I'm pretty sure he's able to just like smoke it, like ah, uh, like when if it's if he has a prescription for like you know when he's off of work and stuff, guys. Maybe they drug test him. I don't know, but been to wherever it is they got what they got, and they knew that the weight or the measurements of of what they had in their possession uh, was exact and. When we get the lab report back, uh, it's a little light in terms of what what the person says they actually had when they got when they got arrested. Doesn't happen often, but it does happen. That that seems to be a prevailing question that a lot of people that have have had their marijuana taken from them. 
Or he's like giving legal advice about cannabis. And, and for the state of Texas, that's a completely needed. But where I live, it not really is. We're going to skip ahead a little, guys. Here, here, here we are. At the most re we'll just keep My playing. Officer, uh, this is the most replayed yeah, part. That's not what's going on. And that's what was going on here. This trooper stopped a man uh, on his way back from Colorado, ended up, allegedly stopped the man for speeding, ended up searching his car, uh, took some uh, vape pens from him. No vape pen cartridges with THC? No? Yeah. You, uh, you, yeah. I, get I do, man. And within five minutes of releasing him, the trooper reached over and got that vape pen out of the seat and was nibbling on it to see what, what it tasted like. Oh my gosh, yo. Went another 25 minutes down the road, pulled over on the shoulder of the road, and um, started hitting on it. The DA's office didn't tell us that. Hey bro, taking full-blown hits, man. Does he not know there's a dash cam, guys? Come on, now. Accidentally inhaled THC, as stupid as that sounds. And I felt it fill up my lungs. I pushed it out as fast as I could, and there was smoke everywhere. I never seen anything smoke so much. I did not mean. Dang, bro. <laughs> you got a good hit there, man. That stuff. That stuff's harsh, bro. The vape pens. I gotta quit vape pens. I, inhale it. I mean, I smoked weed before Highway Patrol. I told them whenever I, I came in. I... The violent coughing of uh, Dab is a man. I told them all about that. It's embarrassing. I was wigged out. Basically, I caught in his own trap. He videotaped on his own camera, tampering with evidence, as they called it. But what disturbs me is this. Thing did somebody like go and review it? How they catch him, guys? I guess we'll never know because uh, we didn't react to the full video. But it'd be cool to, if we knew. Texas Rangers found 20 other cases where this trooper stopped somebody, took their contraband, their 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 THC or their marijuana and it never made it to the evidence box you know he just said we're gonna almost send this into the state lab for destruction and it never made it and what what troubles me is the district attorney's office knows about those 20 other cases i mean it's on video the trooper taking the, the contraband uh and and it never making it to the evidence box oh my gosh bro he's doing it on the job this guy <laughs> So he's, a ser he's doing it serially, bro. Well, the more times he does it, the more likely he's going to get caught. That and along with the, the video of what he's actually doing with this stuff, uh, I don't understand why the trooper was charged with just one count TikTok. of tampering with evidence and Ugh. just one count of possession it, guys. of a controlled substance. I could understand maybe not charging him uh, with multiple counts of possession since they don't actually have the substance there to test. But they certainly got 20 counts of tampering. And that's a third degree. Dang, bro. Tampering. So he did it 20 times, guys. All right. Well, that's only footage we have, guys. I mean, <clears throat> with evidence. I'll, I'll leave a link to the original video in the description if you want to see it. But yeah, guys, he arrests him, he, take, he confiscates it, and then he takes it himself, bro. Uh, it's like he robs them, bro. That's sad. Alright guys, like, like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next video. Peace out, everyone. Thank you for watching. Later, guys.